This is Dabu7. This is an update to the Oroville Dam. It looks like, as of today, they will be bringing this to a stop in terms of the water flow. They have been draining this all the way past 60 feet from its crest when it was initially spilling over the top. They're saying today that they will be clearing debris from the bottom so that they can fire this thing back up and get it working right. Problem is this. You cannot get this working right until the hole is fixed. And that is not what they're talking about doing. This has some people scratching their head, wondering what are you doing if you're stopping the water flow? How come you're not going to have teams in here inspecting this hole or something? Now, they may send a couple people up to look at this. They may not. I'm, they haven't mentioned anything of it at this point. What they have mentioned is that they're sending in crews to the bottom where all this got washed out. And guys, I've got to tell you, this is exactly what me and Casey were warning about. There's a reason why this stuck out to me as being a huge sluice box. You know, a sluice box that catches gold. Well, what this did is this ripped apart all kinds of earth and washed it all down into the area below, exposing tons of earth. To move that amount of earth cost a lot of money. And I also want to remind folks that this is the spot, one of the main spots of the beginning of the gold rush, right here in Orville, where they dammed everything up and created the lake. Can you believe that? Of all things, because of the minerals there. So, they go on to state that they're going to be sending people down to the bottom, where the gold would run off, in this instance, and gather down here to remove rock, debris, and silt. Now, I'm here to tell you, to remove that silt, they're going to need dredges. And if they're down here dredging, they are pulling out gold. Without a doubt. And a lot of it. And there's going to be a lot more to be discovered down here. And the only ones that are going to be able to get in here and do this at the base where a lot of this fell out is going to be the workers for the government and whoever's behind the security line. Now, I'm also here to tell folks, downstream, the Feather River, Yuba City, you got gold hitting your way. I mean, you're in gold country, for crying out loud, but anytime you have this much earth displaced from water washout, you've got gold flowing down through here. So, don't be surprised if when they stop this here this week and the water levels really do start to recede, the people are out there in the rivers and creeks looking for gold because this is the time when you want to do it they're doing it i can guarantee you you're not going to see an article anywhere that talks about them taking the gold out of this area but i'm here to tell you there's no way you send workers into the bottom of a money pit like this the bottom of a sluice box in gold country where a bunch of fresh earth was just plowed open and you're not getting the gold that's at the bottom. I can guarantee you they are. They're not going to say a word about it. It would be very interesting, and I'm going to try to reach out to Sean D. I know he was covering the levels of the Feather River here recently, and I tried to ask him if he knew anything about the gold in the region, but I don't think he's seen my question. Going to see if he can't get back up here and get any footage of what they're doing at the base of this. Because if we see all kinds of dredges hooked up with sluice boxes and everything else on the edge, well, then they're not just pulling out rocks. They're definitely dredging for gold. And to be honest with you, it would be pretty stupid for them not to at this point, considering the amount of gold that's probably sitting down in here. So, just wanted to update and let it be known, this is... The situation currently, the dam being shut off today, well, the spillway being completely shut off, and instead of focusing on fixing the hole and talking about that primarily, they're talking about getting guys down here at the bottom to clean up debris, rocks, silt, and gold. Guarantee it. It's been Dabu 7.